Hey everyone, it's Corey. It's the day after the LASIK procedure and I couldn't be happier. Um, everything yesterday went so smooth. <laughs> Looking back, there was absolutely no reason to be nervous. Um, I got to the office and they gave me a Valium, which was great because I definitely needed it by that time. Um, by the time they took me back to surgery, I thought, you know, maybe you guys want to give me another one of those because I'm still feeling feeling a little bit shaky. I don't know if I can hold still for this. But then I stood up and realized, yeah, that's probably not a good idea. I think I'm doing pretty good. Um, but I got back in the first room and the technician was great, letting me know everything that was going to be done to prepare my cornea for surgery. And Dr. Kraft came in, walked me through the whole thing, step by step, what he was doing, what he wanted me to do. Um... So I never had any question of, am I feeling, is, am I supposed to feel this? Is, you know, what should I, should I blink now? Should I not blink? Should I have my eyes open? Um, everything was answered way in advance, way before I would ever question anything. Uh, so I went through with that. They had me over in the room for the actual LASIK, or LASIK procedure, if I can talk this morning. Um, and I noticed a clock on the wall. And I know my eyes were a little bit cloudy because of the cornea preparation, but my vision sucks anyway. Uh, and I looked up at that and I knew that it was a clock, but I couldn't tell the time. Whatever. So I laid back. Again, Dr. Kraft did a great job explaining what was going to be happening. Um, the procedure on each eye maybe took 30 seconds, and I think I'm being pretty liberal in that. It went seamlessly. Absolutely no pain. I think the most discomfort I had was when they were um, putting the suction on my eyes, uh, or the vacuum, whatever the heck they call it, over in the other room for the cornea preparation. But it wasn't even that uncomfortable. I mean, it was just a little bit of pressure on the eyes, nothing that you couldn't handle, nothing that would make you say, okay, I'm done, forget it, let's just, and I'm not gonna go through with this. Um, it was cake. So anyway, they get done with a LASIK procedure. I sit up and they tell me I can open my eyes and I open my eyes and the first friggin' thing that I see is that clock. And I can see the clock, I can see what time it was. It was, it blew my mind. I was in total disbelief and I'm still sitting here right now doing this. I have these waves of excitement because I'm not wearing contacts. I don't have to take them out tonight and I can see. Um, so anyways, that was like absolutely awesome. I wanted to cry, but I didn't because I didn't want to screw anything up. I didn't know if I should or shouldn't or whatever. Um, but I got back to my hotel room last night and you know, took the medications they gave me. I had no discomfort though, and that was one thing that I thought was just awesome. You know, they told me what I might experience, uh, scratchy eyes, very dry eyes, uh, feeling like maybe there's a, a eyelash in your eye, but I didn't feel any of that. Um, I went to bed, gosh, it was probably only about 6, 6.30 last night. Woke up this morning around one, did a couple of my eye drops, turned the TV on and realized I can see the TV and I'm laying in bed. And I don't have my glasses on. And I can see the TV. I can read the telephone number that they're bleeping across the screen right now. <laughs> um, so I got right up and I went up, opened up the windows. Beautiful, beautiful Chicago lights at night. Looked down, noticed uh, there was a fluorescent sign in the, in the lobby of this building across the way. I'm horrible with distance, so I'm not even going to guess how far away it was. And all I could make out were the last three letters of the sign. And they were a little bit fuzzy. But managed to get back to sleep, woke up again, uh, I don't know, about 5 o'clock, I think it was. Put more drops in my eyes, was walking around the room, reading things, looking at the TV, seeing how far away I could see from the alarm clock and see the time. Opened up the windows again and I looked down and I could read that fluorescent sign like nothing, um, which was a Chase Bank sign. Super clear. And I don't know if it's just me, maybe my level of excitement or what, but my vision seems to be getting better and better with every hour. So it's just, it's, it's words can't even explain what I'm feeling right now, aside from incredibly grateful, incredibly lucky that I had this opportunity. And uh, yeah, I would recommend this to anybody in a heartbeat. So you might notice a little bit of redness in my eyes this morning. That's from the uh, vacuum or the, the deal that they did when they had to prepare my cornea. I wouldn't even know it's there. Um, other than when I look in the mirror, I notice it. So still again today, no discomfort at all. It doesn't feel like anything was done on my eyes. I am being very careful not to touch my eyes, rub my eyes or anything like that, like they did advise. But aside from that, it's like any other day. So I'm going to get ready right now to head over there for my follow up the morning of and see just how good my vision is. Thanks. Thanks to everybody. Thanks to everybody for all the votes again and the likes. I, I'm sending out big virtual hugs to you all. <laughs> all right, I'm out.